Welcome back viewers to another wonderful content of what doing great today of what doing alright so today we have two hot topics to talk about we are going to talk about bougie badass you understand planning to buy a house in Jamaica after vacation also I going to talk about Shakari Richardson's after breaking up relationship with a Jamaican female athlete you see so you know I miss out none of them there so make sure you like the video subscribe and turn on the post notification bell so then miss the latest news and reviews over here and all the people who want to promote share don't know you can link me up on the gram at vlogboss underscore entertainment the zp so we so far out after the intro and build on everything so just stick around we so far out yeah man I don't know a cold boss represent for vlogboss zimmy real vaga da so welcome back viewers first up on this list we got Shakari Richards it's an American sprinter Shakari Richards and says she attempting to heal from emotional trauma including allegedly obophobic which she says she suffered during a relationship with a Jamaican athlete wow wow after so much she did so much problem she now with Jamaica she really got it with a Jamaican athlete moving on Richard to reveal and break up with Jamaica at least it homophobic you understand it understood the relationship between Shakari returns and the Jamaican athlete ending in recent weeks you understand so she posts on her story I say a lot of things about a lot of things you understand and I say oh we oh the girl homophobic and thing and thing like that so me I wonder basically why I know she just recently have come out with that and I talk to the public about that you understand we don't know how she run her mouth so and not her foot you understand basically people don't come at me now but it's just facts at the end of the day you understand me say if you made it to this part of the video just consider liking this video subscribe and turn on the post notification bell you understand me if you know me just tell me in the comment section what you think about that and to me she was shouldn't come up on the internet with this you see because after that with from them time she has say you're ready after the race and you understand come dead foot and you understand me i try to say people so it kind of can confuse me knowing that i'm a jamaican not talking for myself alone worldwide you know me not think she wouldn't come for me like this as a big athlete look like it's fame she looking for her and stuff like that you understand me? so she recently posted this on her instagram talking about the situation i was in a relationship with a jamaican athlete that never cared about me from jump i was abused and stole from yet protected her from the judgment of her country and family while they dragged me and and i had to deal with all of the homophobic and so on and so on people so the list goes on and on and on and on so basically more than them more than thousand in the comment section and thing and thing Move, moving on to the next one so basically we have a little article to talk about the whole situation of him tour and stuff like that and also him buying a land in Jamaica. So we we'll open and enjoy the article and big up on yourself. Whenever that finish, I don't know the video done. So big up to everybody knows so until the time out. I say thanks to everybody who really support me from day one and watch my content on a daily basis. So you don't know. Give thanks to all of that. You understand at the end of the day. So big up and stay tuned for more content. Just subscribe, like this video, turn on the post notification bell so you never miss the next video. After his recent vacation on the island. American rapper Boosie Badass has fallen in love with Jamaica and says he's looking into acquiring property on the island. During a new sit-down with DJ Vlad of Vlad TV, the Don Dada rapper said he is smitten by the island's beauty and culture and will be purchasing land to build a house. I love Jamaica, man, he said. I'm finna get some land down there and build me a home. Vlad chimed in and agreed, Jamaica is dope. Out of all the countries I've been in, in terms of natural beauty, the beauty of the land and the mountains and the sea. Boosie spent some downtime in Jamaica just over a month ago and shared his enjoyment with social media users through various posts. He could be seen sporting clothes in the Rastafarian colors, coupled with faux locks. He also seemed to have gotten along with the staff at the resort he was staying at. A clip surfaced of Hun referring to himself as a Don Dada while engaging with a hotel worker. The rapper believes he got an exceptional welcome from the people on the small island. The food, and they love me in Jamaica. Man, in other countries, people don't understand. It ain't too many mother ing rappers bigger than me in other countries. Especially countries who stands on real shish tea, he said. The controversial rapper, who was handed a lifetime ban from Instagram, said that he earned the respect of the natives because he allegedly speaks up for people. Don Dada in the United States, you're a general, man. No mother king rappers stick up for you man. They leave you out in the cold. No one speaks up for you, man, he said in his best Jamaican accent. Boosie also brought his mother and daughter on the trip, and was taken aback when they were getting a lot of male attention. During the time, he had taken to Twitter to voice his surprise at how the Jamaican men were lusting after his mother in particular. 
Nia's trying to hit on moms, man, Busi, your mother is so beautiful mon, beautiful mon, he said, trying to impersonate them as best as possible. God damn, mama got on a little one piece. I said mama what are you doing? Put some f king shorts on. Lil ass hanging out. Mama got on a one piece, man. Mama got on a one piece. Yeah, man, my mama looking good for her age, the rapper said. According to him, his daughter did not escape the admiring eyes either. The mother fasterisk asterisk curs man, and they was on my daughter. Oh lord Jesus, he said with a head shake and palm to the face. Based on social media posts, Boosie, whose mansion is located in Atlanta, is currently in Miami enjoying another vacation.